Good morning, guys. Right now it's 7:30. Um, I'm on the school bus heading to downtown Toronto towards Fort York uh, Armory. Uh, this is a cadet event. Uh, this event is is a drill competition. So uh, for the past few months, uh, our my squadron's my squadron's drill team, including my uh, drill commander, have been practicing our foot drill and our commands. Uh, we've been practicing very hard, and hopefully, this year's uh, drill team competition, we can, be, we can be placed up in a spot where we feel proud of ourselves because obviously, in the, fa in the past few months, we've been practicing very hard. Um, and today's the day, so once I get to Fort uh, York Armory, um, the won't, I won't have time to uh, to let you guys see what's been placed for the competition. I have to go in there straight, get changed up, and prepare myself for the competition because we literally start uh, in an hour, and um, there's and after that. Um, I'll see if I can able to record other squadrons to perform their drill, their drill, and, um, and then after the drill competition, there's a there's the band competition, which again I'll try to record some of it for you guys, and um, yeah, pretty much that's all the uh, events that are going on today. So. Um, Obviously, feeling really tired right now, so go take a quick nap before we get there. And um, yeah, so see you downtown. All right, hey guys. So right now I am at Fort York Armory in downtown Toronto. Um, I have to keep my voice very low. Um, I don't know how would that affect the sound quality on um on YouTube, but. Anyways, I had to keep my voice down because um, obviously there are other cadets in the space that are doing drill. Um, my squadron's drill team um, we finished, and um, I was about to film me the transfer this transfer the transformation of me from my from my civilian clothes to uniform, but that didn't work because of time. And um, so far. My squad's drill team, including my our drill commander, uh, we did absolutely um, well. We did kind of good because we didn't do the freestyle we were supposed to, but um, we didn't have time to do a freestyle, and we didn't have time to practice. But um, anyways, uh, overall we did pretty good. And um, right now I'm sorry to say with my friends, those who are playing with games and too. And anyways, um, too. Uh, for your opinion, how how well did we did for the um for the drill thing? I guess we did okay. It's just that the thing is we have to like so the routine can pop kind of struggle through, but we can try to improve it for next year's drill comp. So for next year's uh, drill comp, which is the um <laughs> CO, is it is it called C CO three O eight or? <laughs> Yeah, so it's called, it's, for next year, it's just the CO308 drill comp. Um, for that, we... Okay, so um, there was a quick pause right there um, because of storage that I'm on my phone, so... Um, anyways, um, hopefully we can do better in the 308 drill comp next year. Um, yeah, so pretty much I'm here at Fort York Armory for the rest of the day until like maybe like 5 p.m. in the afternoon and um, yeah so I'll try my best to film other squadrons perform drill drill and also later on in the afternoon um, there's also a band competition so I'll try to record some of that especially my squadrons band I'll try to record that
Okay guys, so this next clip right here, um, this is uh, my friend's uh, performance drill. Um, shout out to Vice Sergeant uh, Di Patrick. Um, uh, Di, if you're watching this, uh, if you're watching my videos, um, I want to say uh, you guys did an awesome job out there. Um, I love your freestyle. It was very lit. Nice job. And um, yes, yeah, so shout out to you, buddy. And um, here's the clip.
Alright guys, so right now it's currently 2.30 and my Scottish band is about to go on right now.
So, in Cadets, those are just some of the, well, for my squadron, Band and Drill are just some of the competitions that we participate in. There are others. We also participate in marksmanship, sport, and swimming, so all together including Drill and Band, my squadron participates in five competitions. And I gotta say, going to these comps is a lot of fun. Um, you get to meet your old friends that you already have made before, and sometimes new people there as well. Um, but the biggest one, the biggest one, yet yeah, is uh, you get to show off. You, uh, your, uh, you and your team get to show off what you have been doing in the past in the past few months. Um, and that's pretty much. The biggest one yet, uh, just by sh uh, going to these comms, showing everybody what you and your team have been doing, um, and yeah, I'll say that was the biggest one, biggest one yet, whether it's in band, drill, or marksmanship, you get to show them off, and it feels good to show what you have been doing in the past few months. Um, like I said before, uh, when I was still at Fort York Armory, or no, not Fort York, um, there was a name error for that. It's actually, that was actually Moses Park Armory. Not Fort York, Moses Park. I kind of got confused of the names of it because um, at first I heard, oh, we're going to Fort York Armory. But now, like, but when I got there, it was like, oh, to say Fort York is Moses Park Armory. So um, got confused of the name. But anyways, um, uh, I don't think I had ever told you guys about this before, but if I had, I obviously for have forgotten or don't remember about it. But um, as you, what you just saw, um, I'm obviously in the cadet program. I've been in cadets for four years now. Um, I'm hoping that in the summer month of June or maybe next year, I'll get my fourth year service mount. And then... After I receive my fourth year service medal, I'm thinking of staying in cadets for another year. So pretty much, uh, that'll be that'll be the fifth year. So pretty much, uh, once you get your fourth year service medal, if you stay another year, which is your fifth year, um, at some point, you will receive a fifth year service pin, and pretty much, I think that's the highest service year you can be in cadets. Um, I'm thinking of staying in cadets for, well, once I have received my fourth year service medal, I'm thinking of staying in cadets for another year until I retire, at the rank, retire out of the cadets out of, um, at the rank of vice sergeant, which is basically three chevrons and a crown. Most people, they, uh, most people, they retire out of cadets at the rank of warrant officer either first class or second class but most of the times uh other just others just retire out of cadets at the rank of vice sergeant or sergeant so for me i'm thinking of once i get my rank of vice sergeant um i might retire out of cadets at that time or maybe not i don't know i'm still deciding whether i should retire of retire out of cadets at the rank of vice sergeant or Keep going and become a warrant officer. I don't know, still deciding. But time will soon tell. I'd like to give these people a shout out. Well, I'm not gonna read their names, but here's a list of people uh, of people that I'm getting shout outs to. Alright, so that will conclude this video. Um thanks for watching. If you guys like the video, please leave a like. Got any comments, drop it down below. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Don't forget to share my videos with your friends. Tell them to subscribe. And another thing is, um, so far right now, I only have 236 subs on my channel. Let's try to reach up to 500 subs as soon as possible, guys. And that's our goal. Reaching to 500 subs is our goal. So... Uh, tell your friends about my channel, share my videos, and I'll see you. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.